Okay, let's talk culinary here in Charlottesville. We're talking passion on the plate. <laughs> here we go. It's happening right now. This is Tristan, Oak Heart Social, owner, chef. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. My goodness. Does Charlottesville have a culinary identity? Yeah, I think it does. Um, and it's, a, you know, an evolving thing, but I would, I would describe it as a very eager and ambitious food town. Is it, does it have something to do with the ingredients and the availability of the fresh ingredients where you're not just pulling stuff off a truck, you really can get out there and, and source these things? Certainly, yeah. There's a great, great farming community here. A lot of, of uh, really, really great fertile soils and um, engaged, interested, and passionate farmers. Thank you. And a really long growing season, which for, for me, coming from up north, is, is great. I live somewhere that peaches grow. <laughs> and that's kind of awesome. That's kind of cool. How does someone find, you know, look, the restaurant scene changes. It's hard to own a restaurant. It's hard to stay in business. It's hard. And we totally get that, which means that scene is, there's a lot of turnover. Mm -hmm. How does somebody find the right place for them? I don't know. I, I mean, mean it's, it's not, I, I say that because it, they're always like, do, do we do Yelp reviews where, mm -hmm. yeah, I'd like to take the advice of, you know, 400 strangers. I don't yeah, know. Like, no, I think, that it, I think that it boils down to... Um, Authenticity, um, honesty, yeah. uh, really simple fundamental things that make human endeavors successful regardless of what they are. And I think that when you do something that you have some real ownership over, it translates much more easily than if you don't. Um, Makes and sense. in communities like this, that's appreciated much more than some other communities. Because there is an appetite, yeah. no pun intended. And, and, well, right, you know, and, and people here have. Um, an open mind. Uh, they're willing to try things that aren't strip steak with a red wine reduction. You know Which, what I mean? There's nothing wrong with nothing that. Nothing wrong with that. But we're looking for something else. But yeah. And you got to get out there and do it. That's mm -hmm. the other problem. Is you can read about it, but you got to go out and try things. Yeah. The the interesting thing is the amount of people trying things here versus the size of the town. Hmm. That um, makes a lot of sense. There's a lot of a lot going on here. Where do you go when you go out? Um, when I <laughs> when you want, which is almost never, um, I assure you, well, there's, children. There's a lot families. of options, and there's a great community um, of chefs and and bartenders and. Um, Any neighborhoods that stick wife, out to you? Yeah, well, this mid uh, midtown neighborhood. Yep. We have our friends Maya down the street, a great local butcher, Jamstock Provisions, Toll Animal Butchery, All Virginia. Mm -hmm. um, down the road is Belmont, and we have great friends over there at Lompo. Mm -hmm. um, they do great, uh, great, great food, great pizza, and Tavola, also Tavola. Italian. I don't know. There's just a ton. There's of a lot. And when we come here, what are we having? What can we experience here? My food is about big flavors um, in relatively small bites. Um, so it's not it's not small plates, not tapas. It's food that's intended and encouraged to be shared, mm -hmm. and, and talk with your mouth full. Um, get a few different plates, all of them will be unique, and uh, there are, there's not a lot of redundancy in flavor. But then, of course, it's also driven seasonally by all the great products around here. Um, and we also really enjoy and support the, the wine scene mm -hmm. around Charlottesville, Virginia, mm -hmm. which is prolific. Mm -hmm. And perfect for pairing. Absolutely. I'm speaking in all alliterations after 4 o'clock today. <laughs> Tristan, thank you, Chef. Pleasure. We appreciate it. We have something to eat. We'll be doing this while you take a look at, uh, well, that. <laughs> Soon.